in uh, exercise 6 the question is a copper wire has diameter of 0 0.5 millimeter so diameter of the copper wire is 0 0.5 millimeter that means 0 0.5 into 10 power minus 3 meter resistivity 1.6 into 10 power minus 8 ohm meter so rho is equal to 1.6 into 10 power minus 8 ohm meter what will be the length of the wire to make it resistance 10 ohm so length is what to make resistance 10 ohm how does the resistance change if the diameter is doubled if the diameter become doubled what is the resistance change we have to find here so here so we have a formula r is equal to rho l by a area we don't have but indirectly they are given diameter so L wire is equal to by r square so by is 3.14 r is d by 2 so we can write d squared by 2 then it becomes 3.14 into 0 0.5 into 10 power minus 3 by 2 the whole square 3.14 into 0 0.25 into 10 power minus 6 by 4 this is area okay now we have a value fine okay but here here they are asking about length here they are asking length so l become r a by rho what is our r here 10 into area 3.14 into 0 0.25 into 10 power minus 6 by 4 into rho value 1.6 into 10 power minus 8. L is equal to 10 into 3.14 into 0 0.25 into 10 power minus 6 by 4 into 1.6 into 10 power minus 8. 10 power minus a denominator if you take into numerator then plus 8 then it become a 10 power 8. 10 power 8 10 power minus 6 then it become a 10 power 2. Okay. If you solve means you will get answer 166.2 meter. We will get the 166.2 meter. Then L become. If you solve means you will get answer 122.6 meter. The length become 122.6 meter. Next, if the diameter is doubled, second one. So D become 2D. What is the new resistance? Okay. New resistance they are asking. What is the change in resistance? Then we have to compare that previous resistance and new resistance. First one is R is equal to rho L by A. So rho L by by this is d d by 2 the whole square then we will get rho l by d square by 4 then become a rho l into 4 by by d square this is for first one resistance now here diameter become 2d then r dash is equal to rho l by a and it become rho l by by here r what is r here r become t by 2 then it is d by 2 d by 2 2 2 cancel then r become d okay then here by r squared then d squared the new r is rho l by by d squared okay this one is we will take equation 2 this one is equation 1. 
Now we'll compare that equation 2 and 1. So we can equation 2 divide by equation 1. We will take this is r dash. Then r dash by r is equal to rho l by by d squared into by d squared by 4 rho l. Now see that rho l rho l cancel by d squared by d squared cancel. Then r dash is equal to r by 4. Here only 1 by 4 is remaining. So r dash is equal to r by 4. So the new resistance is nothing but 1 by 4 times r dash become 1 by 4 times of r. 1 by 4 times of r. That is the answer.